Hi, welcome to OMG Old Man Golf. The 2020 golf season starts right now. It's finally here. We're at day 131 without golf. Today is actually day 132, and I am headed to Fair Golf Course. Can't wait. I'm going to suck, but that's okay. I'm playing golf. It feels good to be back on the golf course. The first hole is a 376-yard par 4 playing uphill, and I'm hitting driver. Kind of push it out to the right a little bit. Got a 6-iron hitting at LAW, a.k.a. long-ass ways. All right, got 9-iron from the sweet spot, 118. Come on, hit the green. No, I left it out. Go for one on the sweet spots. Got the 8-iron in my hand, though. All right, I get that up there close. And I make the putt to make the up and down. Nice. Bogey's a good ho good way to start the round. All right, the second hole is a 419-yard par 4, wide fairway. Let's hit it. Now I missed the fairway out to the right just a little bit. Going to get into the sweet spot with the 6-iron. All right, got 140 with a 7-iron. Ooh, Shuri, that's bound to happen. All right, got 45 yards hitting the lob wedge. A little chip in there. All right, let's make this up and down. No, that's a double. Missed the up and down. One for two on up and down. The third hole is a 331-yard par four. And I pick up my playing uh, mate for the day, Joe Yolkum. It's really the right name. Joe for us English speakers. All right, so I got a six iron from 145. I'm hitting in. And uh, I got a birdie putt. Birdie putt, you got to like that. Nope. Bet I just got a little tap in here for par. Par. All right, the fourth hole is a 417-yard par four. The dog legs right, and I'm hitting driver. And I think I just kept it out of the hole. Yeah, you know, there I am, just barely out of the hole. I hit a six iron. Try to get myself into a spot where I can reach. And I hit that pretty good. All right, so I got nine iron from 120. Come on, I'm in the sweet spot. Let's get it on the green. No. Oh, uh, for two on the sweet spots. I got eight iron chip, though. Anything can happen when I got the eight iron in the hand. All right, the fifth hole goes uphill and dog lays left. 342 right, bad. yards. And I hit a really nice one. All right, right I make uh, it. 138 and another up and down. I left it out to the right. I don't know if that's alignment or I'm not closing. I'm in the sand, wet, in the sand hitting sand wedge out. And that didn't go well. So I'm on the other side, don't have an up and down, missed the green from the sand bunker. So I chip it up with my sand wedge. And I uh, up on the green, got a bogey putt. The thing at the top of the screen is my new fancy microphone, which uh, I got to figure out how to get, get that out of the shot all the time without taking a bunch of time to do so. All right, double bogey. Not so good. That's not a hard hole. Shouldn't be a double bogey. The sixth hole is a 167 yard par three, and I'm hitting the three hybrid. Hole plays long because it's a really elevated green to get up. So 
kind of got to fly it there or hit something uh, much longer to get it on. And I hit that ball poorly. So I got a nine iron punch. And I didn't quite get that on. So I'm 0 for 3 from the sweet spot. That's terrible. I got an eight iron chip. Let's see if I can save an up and down here. I got a bogey putt. Nope. Double bogey five. Two for four on the ups and downs. All right, not happy with the back-to-back -back double bogeys, but hell, after 130-something days, what am I expecting? All right, got a sharp par four here, but you got to you gotta kick the field goal. Split those trees with your driver. I do. It's to the right a little bit, but I, I'm in the fairway. Got 9-iron from 120. Let's hit it from the sweet spot. Come on. All right. On the green, got a birdie putt. This is really a makeable birdie putt. I left it right in the heart, but not on, not in. Par. But I'll take it. All right, here goes Joe on the eighth hole, a 289-yard par four with the tree in the middle. Perfect. <laughs> Thank you. Like it's on remote control. <laughs> nice. Thank you. Did you hit that shot before having to. <laughs> All right, I got to keep up with him. Hit a nice one here. I just aim for the tree, and if I hit it, I usually don't hit what I'm trying to aim at anyway. Just went under the right wow. branches. Well, you look like we know it. All right, so I got gap wedge from 90 yards. 90 yards is kind of tough, so I, I, I hit my gap wedge, which is my 100-yard club, trying to get it on the green. The three-putt music. Oh, two for five, I reach in, regulation, and I get the three-putt music. Ninth hole, 340 yard par four, dog legs right, and I hit it right into the sun, and it goes off into the sun, and I have no idea where it is. It feels like it's in the middle. We'll ha just have to go see. Joe's up. And he does the same thing. He hits a good ball, but we can't find either one of our balls in the fairway. Very, very frustrating. So he's dropping and hitting. And he hits it well. But I'm without wheels on the truck. Lost ball. I didn't film an eight iron that I hit crappy. And now here I am under this tree, hitting my four shot, a lob wedge. And it does it, it catches the tree. And uh, Joe's in the bunker and I'm in the bunker. We both uh, managed to find the bunker. Two for six on the sweet spots. No bueno. I really hit a good sand shot. I mean, really nice. So here's Joe. He hits left-handed, but he putts right-handed. I've got uh, one for two out of the bunkers hitting the green. Come on, make this putt for six. Nope. I make a seven. Seven. Well, I shot 47 on the front. 
that triple bogey on the last hole didn't help. Um, really disappointed. I, I hit a good drive and I just couldn't find it. So I took, had to take a lost ball and then missed a putt I should have made. Oh well. 47. Let's get it on the back nine. All right, that was a long layoff, 130-something days. I hope that never happens again. My swing held up. You know, I guess maybe watching my videos helped me uh, keep my swing. And I hit my driver well, so I have no complaints there. I need to finalize my improvement plan. Sweet spots, sand bunkers, and up and downs will certainly be part of the plan. Stay with me, golf gangsters. Subscribe and tell your friends.